Hi, 22 Haitian baby. I want to say happy Veterans Day for me and my Billy, my daughter. You see, I did her little red, white, and blue little. I just put her hair in pink tails and then the tips I braid it and put a barrette on it. For anyone who's interested because I haven't done another video of, of doing her hair I'll do that soon but anyway here get. anyway I am here to talk about hair and also to give you an update on my weight even though you guys some of you don't care but I don't care anyway first let me just do the weight okay so I have been counting my calories and eating more vegetables and as you can see, let's see, put it up just a little. As you can see, look at this shirt actually looks the way it's supposed to look. You know how you buy a shirt and it flares out? See, this one is flaring out. Before it would have been like like that, but now it's not. Let me put this down. See? Not sucking up my gut or anything. See? As you can see, my stomach is going down my rolls is going down this one right here no not this one this one's still here this one that was right here see the crease it's not there anymore see it's going away like that now I am still 200 pounds see I'm still 200 pounds but see the hangness of the belly is going up and going a little you know hopefully I get like this but still see and it actually flares out before it would have been tight and this is an extra large so it would have been tight on me but now it's not see it's not too bad anymore my daughter loves to see my belly <laughs> maybe because she lived there so much so long anyway um I'm wearing my Bare Minerals makeup, and yeah, I, I just don't like the way it looks sometimes, because sometimes it makes, like it does now, make my face look greasy. But I'm here to talk about curls and how to keep your weave in perfect curls. Sometimes your hair get old, because I'm able to keep a curly a hair, the longest curly hair I kept in was three months. That's because I first moved to Chicago, uh, uh, from Chicago to Kentucky. I didn't know where any hair store was, and it was hard for me to find a hair store. By the time I found one, it was three months. And it was synthetic hair by Free Stress. I don't remember the name of the hair. I think I said it before in my previous videos, but I was able to keep it intact. Like, intact. It was like one of those big afro, but not afro. You know, like one of those... Um, wet and wavy type hair but it wasn't wet and wavy and it was like it looks like a fro but it, it had a little curl in it but anyway um, yeah so uh, I got my earrings from Route 21 my shirt from Route 21 you know I gotta tell and my jeggings 588 at Walmart I just have to tell you guys that but anyway about hair now, um, this is a number 33, um, and I just put a little highlight of 30 on it. Now, it kind of looks like a number 4 with 30 on it, so it's like one of those, because, you know, 33 is really tricky. It usually looks maroon, or it looks red, or it looks very red, or it looks kind of like like a little calm down. This one is the one that's calmed down. Like, as you guys can see, because of the color of the shirt, because the shirt is kind of like brown, the shirt is bringing out the color so you really can see the a little bit like the redness of it compared to if I wore like a red shirt you it would have looked brown like a number four but it's a number 33 I love this 33 I wanted red hair I didn't want it too bright red like kool-aid red not you know I've had it that red before but um I didn't want it like that. So anyway, this one is a um, deep, new deep wave because the shorter you go, it's always new deep wave. This is a 10 inch. The blonde is at 8 inch. Now I didn't put, this is a circle weave. I didn't put it like all around. I just literally put highlights like up here, up here, like in the front and that's it. It was just from left over here from the last time I did my hair um, when I had a number four and I had the highlights of the 30. So it's from that pack. Now, 
the best, um, this is, I believe this is humid hair mixed with synthetic. That's what I'm believing. Cause especially the way that this is going by, uh, old fast. That's what I'm guessing. So in order to get your hair volume and have it stay for a long time, what I use is the best thing to use, even for synthetic human, all my stuff, wet and wavy. Wet and wavy. This is the best product for curly hair. Curly, wavy, any hair with a texture in it, this is the best one if you're trying to hold on to it. Now, I, I, I did put this hair on last week. So because it is um, human mixed with synthetic, and I'm used to synthetic. So because it is that type of hair... Before I did this video, because I it's Veterans Day, I just went out with my husband. I just came back in the house. Um, the hair was looking like it's been in my head for a month. Well, at least two weeks, I should say. Which, I guess, no, a week. Because I put it last Sunday, so it's going to be a week on Sunday. This Sunday. So, but the problem is I've been keeping it in, you know, those those silk caps that you put to go to the bed. I've been keeping it in there because I'm a housewife. I really don't go many places, honestly, um, if it's not shopping. I really don't go any places. So, I just keep it in there and it was getting old and um, staticky. Now, what I do, I go like that. I separate my hair in twos, okay? And what I do is I don't spray it or if you have the spray, this is the mousse I have. Um, this is my first time using the mousse, and I like the mousse, but, so I go like that, and I clip, I, I, you know, clip one side like that, and I literally, one, one by one, take apart the curls, okay, so, say that, let me get one curl, say that this is, you see how this is one curl, you separate it, and make it two, now I do that all the way, even in the front, I do that all the way, and one side, and then I do it to, no, and then after I, I um, after the, it gets its volume, it doesn't matter when you separate it, the, the roots of it get kind of like, you know, you know, hard to like take out, but the root, I like when the root is tangled, only because it's, um, when it's tangled, it makes it more volume, and if it's human, then it's easy for you to detangle it. But I like it because it, it's not too tangled where it's like you can't take the hair out. But um, it gives it more volume and also you're not going to, it's curly hair. You're not combing it out. Unless it's like virgin indie Remy hair where you straighten it, then that's when you should care about it. But aside from that, it's not. Like if it's virgin Indian hair, you use a big tooth comb and comb it out. But if it's like synthetic hair... You could still use a big tooth comb or a, a big brush like I usually do. But if you want it like very big, nothing works better than your own hands. And uh, anyway, so after I separate the curls, I spray, 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 scrunch, and fluff out, fluff out. And I do the other one on the other side. See? Now, the good thing, the thing you should learn about um, curls, never try to fix it. Never try to fix it. Now, if you just want to go like that and put it apart, then fine. You could do that. But when I say fix, I mean, I've seen people, they they literally try to go like that. See? They try to... Now, I'm going to show you guys so you guys can see the difference. Like, they try to smooth down the curl. Smooth down the curl. Fix it. Smooth down. Okay. Now, when you step outside the wind, everything is going to be blowing on it. Now, look. Look at this one and this one. With the same part and everything. This one looks way better. I, I really don't care to part it this way. I like it this way better. But see... After I spray it, I spray it one more time, and then I go crazy, just shake the hair, everything, shake my head, do the up and down thing, everything. And then, uh, make sure I get all the hair out of my eye, and then I go. See? This one looks better. 
with curls, you guys have to remember, don't fix the curls. The curls don't need to be fixed. Curls are meant to be wild. That's what make them, that's that's the difference between curly hair and straight hair. Now, straight hair is the one that has to be bone dry straight and it has to be fixed. Like, you have to fix it that way. But curly hair is not meant to be fixed. It's meant to be, you know, wild. Let let it run the way it runs. You know, let it run the way it runs. So that way when the wind don't blow, in, blow in on it, you don't be like, oh, my hair is messed up. If you if you really want to fix your hair, get straight hair. Don't get curly hair. That is the best tip I could tell you. After you spray it, just go crazy with it. But remember, you could use a big tooth comb, uh, um, a big brush, like a paddle brush. Brush it out when you have the curls. Or finger curl it when you first have it. Finger like Use your curl like a big uh, tooth comb. Curl it. I mean, brush it. You know, go like that with it. My best method that I always... You know, that I always have compliments with people like, oh, your hair is nice. It's when I physically go curl by curl and separate the curls. Now, if you want to go through the root like this, you know, and separate it with your finger going down like that and separate it, they'll go right ahead. But for me, it's easier to just go like that, go like that, separate. Now, you don't, there's some that may give you problems, just rip it apart. And if they're still static, what me and my sister do, we go to through the static and literally cut the statics out. So after I'm done styling, which, see, as you guys can see, there is no static for me. So, but if there were, and if it really bothers me that much, because wet and wavy, they're pretty good. They, they pretty much, um, uh, what do you call it, um, take away that static. They pretty much take away that static. So, um, if it does it, which I, ne I never experienced it not doing that, then you go with the scissors and literally cut the status, because the status always out in the front of the hair, and then you just cut the statics and you'll be okay. But that is my little tip for you guys for um, how to preserve your curls. You do it that way because I've been doing that that way for that one time I told you with free stress, which free stress is nothing but synthetic hair. If I could do it for three months, there's no reason why you guys can't do it with uh, Wet and Wavy. Wet and Wavy is the best product. So um, let me know what you guys' tips are um, for what you guys do for um, keeping your hair egg uh, tack. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe. And um, happy Veterans Day from us both. And have a good day. Bye.